so I've got a bunch of questions from viewers and subscribers asking where does my network cable go or I have a Cat6 plug in my room, where does it go? Well today, I'm going to give you the quickest and most simple answer to this important question. Most houses built in the last 15 years have network cables wired to most of the rooms and even areas like kitchens or game rooms. So where do all these network cables go? When I say network cable, that refers to Cat5e, Cat6, Cat7, or even Cat8. No matter which cable you have in your walls, the process is exactly the same. All these network cables will meet up in one central location in your house. And this central location is called a network panel or patch panel. The places to find these panels are in closets, laundry rooms, utility rooms, garages, basements, or even an attic. So you'll want to look in these areas to find the network cables. If your network panel is nowhere to be found, oh. then you'll need to look outside for this panel. If it's outside, it's most likely to be next to your electrical box, which is probably next to your garage. If this box is outside, make sure to secure it with a lock. And one more thing, within this network panel, you should have a modem, and from that modem, a network cable should go to a router. Almost all routers have five ports, one incoming and four outgoing ports. If your house has four network cables, then you're good to go. If you have more than four, then you're going to need to purchase a switch. And then from the router, connect a network cable to that switch. Switches come in different variations, five port switch, eight port switch, and even 10 port switches. So I hope this helped answer your question. And feel free to ask a question in the comment section down below. Once again, I want to thank you for watching. And remember, if you like these videos, give a thumbs up and share it. If you love them, hit subscribe. It's free.